You remember packing whatever you can and moving to Sacramento. However, upon arrival, you found that, for whatever reason, you didn't feel like you could handle another run. Perhaps that last one shook you up more than you thought it did. Your arrival at the Lone Star office in Seattle. Oh, you arrive at the Lone Star office in Seattle. If anyone knows the identity of James Garrett, if he's someone who works here. Taxi. You tried to sleep as much as you can on the ride over, it could. You tried to sleep as much as you could on the ride over, but even then it wasn't enough. Still, your eyes are wide open, your pace is quick and energized, your mind is clear, and your goal is set. And I don't mean to be like, <clears throat> excuse me, I don't mean to like pick out problems in people's writings. I know these are like not professionally made mods most of the time, but I mean a lot of them are done really well, and being an English major, um, those are the things where my brain just sees them and it's like, hey, that's incorrect grammar. Because I always use correct grammar, even when drunk. Seriously, you should have... I, I, I'm kind of sad I deleted that video now, but it was terrible. Anyway, welcome back to Shadowrun Returns Mods. Sha Run from the Shadow... No, this is Moonlight something. I don't remember. I've been playing this for like 20 whole minutes now or something. Hi. Do you know who this is? Fat man in a black coat looks at the reception with tired of focused eyes. What is it, Amy? I got work to do. This guy had this. Where'd you get this? I can't say. You may not believe it. Trust me. I'll believe anything at this point. Take him to the interrogation room. Gotta make a few calls. Hey, come on, man. Next, it's just me getting the crap beaten out of me by that guy. Hot pockets. <sighs> yeah. Freaking finally! You know how many times I had to call you? <sighs> I was gonna answer, but I figured it was you, so I didn't. I'm funny, smartass. You still didn't tell me where the hell you are. Seattle. Something came up. Seattle? What in the devil's salt earth are you doing over there? You know what? Never mind. I don't want to hear it. I've got a lot of paperwork to do. I've got you up in friggin' Seattle? And on top of that, this frickin' Drake keeps asking for you. Who's asking for me? Let him tell you himself. Oh, I'm almost sick. Thank you, Mr. Benson. Thank you, Mr. Benson. It's not an issue I wish to have this conversation privately. Fine, what have I got business suits and do anyway? Hello, brother. P.S. you listen to Father's words. This is very good. Father, brother, what are you talking about? You are my brother. My senior, in fact. Father is our guide. You will learn your own ways when you accept the light of the new moon. I will see you home. The fuck? A large, pissed-off-looking orc. And this is how the truck of horn. Nah, dead man just talked to me. I'm sure that's what happens. How and why could I make this stuff up? James is a friend of mine. He and I sent out, were sent out to investigate something on behalf of a lot of people. The Artangia. Not just them. A few corporate branches, too. See, Lone Star had complaints regarding stolen weapons and equipment from these people, particularly cyberware parts. I wrote it off to Shadowrunners, but James had a different idea. He had done some investigating and told me about some uh, underground cult. He said they called themselves the Prophets of the New Moon, and that every member he came across was heavily augmented. Then I was interested, of course. I didn't buy the whole cult story. Best it was a front for some criminal group or new gang. But I told him I would help him with the investigation, but the next day he disappeared. 
He wouldn't answer my calls, and he made no attempt to made no attempt to to communicate, or he made no attempt communicating in communicating with anyone. He made no attempt to communicate with anyone. Would probably be better. The Lone Star put a notice out to be on the lookouts for any information pertaining his whereabouts, but so far nothing came up. As far as I could tell, he's part of this cult now. Question is, how the hell he's still alive? Are you sure you killed him? I doubt a group like this is capable of bringing people back from the dead. I kind of sliced up his body. Sure you confiscated an SMG on me? It was one of the guns they used belonged to the Werners at some point. Wieners. Oh, to the Wieners. Yeah, wiener, Wieners. Saying you're stealing from the gangsters, too. Interesting. Well, Yoshihiro, I'll give you your equipment back. Maybe my spheres will believe all this. I'll try to contact you if anything changes. All right. Meet me in the Huntsman Tavern if you have anything new. Huntsman. Right. Thank you for cooperating with us. Beep. I like to think that in the future, you have to make that pose. Oh, it's over? Well, uh, nah. Okay. All the good ones end really quickly. Um, dang. Mr. Um, whoever made this. Good job. Good job. I like Oh, some guy. 0110595. Good job. Um, uh, From the Shadows Run was really freaking cool, too. Um, we did. Did we do Life on a Limb? Yes, this is the one where I just couldn't do anything immediately. I think. Lost Lamb, I got stuck. Um, like, literally could not move. Um, Sir Cold. Did I do Sir Cold? I know I did Stitch in Time. From the Shadows Run, Moonlight Prophecy, Lost Lamb, Life on a Limb. Let's try Sir Cold, or at least let's start Sir Cold. I wish I could just import, like, my other mod characters. Just have, like, a mod... ...guy. This is, this is the character I play my mods with. Unless the mods freeze my game. Hello! <sighs> this happens sometimes with mods. Um, I may not have downloaded the... Like, that's one of the things I really don't like about, like, some mods. There's some mods where you can just play them. There's other mods where you can't just play them. And there's some mods where you have to be, you know, double checking every crosses of the T's. Well, it looks like this isn't gonna load. I think we tried it and this is what happened. I'm pretty sure that's what happened. So, um, yeah, thanks for watching everybody. I'm gonna look for some new mods. Um, again, if you have any that you are feeling that you've played or that you've heard about that are really good, um, send me a link to it, or just let me know how I can find it down in the comments there, because um, I really love these mods when they work properly. Um, and if you're a modder out there and you want some help with like even just grammar correction, I'll do it. You know, like I freaking love. I'd be honored to be a part of something like this, and even if it's just like working, like spell checking grammar, um, word choice, if just even some writing, like, I'd be f very willing to help out, so, um, yeah, I'll see you next time, adios, have a good one.